I want to show this map too, which is related to this one. This this map of the three continents, its, it's precursor is the TNO map, um, which has the three continents, Asia, Africa, and Europe. And, again, and this is from the seventh century. And what it does is it, it creates Europe as separate from Asia, and it, it divides the world into these three continents with the Mediterranean and the Nile. And, and then there's like an O of ocean, so a T and O map. And notice that this map maps on a biblical story. Here you see Shem, um, Ham, and Japheth. This biblical story uh, is from the tale of, of Noah's Ark and Noah's three sons. Noah's three sons, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. And Ham is supposed is, is known as the cursed son. Europe's maps have mapped on Ham onto Africa, cursing Africa, and Shem onto Asia, which is where Semitic comes from. So when Europeans are calling Jews in Europe Semites, it is to relegate them over to Asia. They don't belong in Europe. So this whole term of anti-Semitic, it's it's a very strange history, a, a very racist history as well, because it's connected to this curse of Ham. So Europe's geographic imagination has been that Africa, which is so close to Europe and the Iberian Peninsula is right at the border between this construction of, of Europe and the continent of Africa. And so European identity has been created as a, a negative, as a, as a reference of the positive to the negative of Africa and uh, Asia being over in the West, closer to heaven, closer to where the Holy Land is. So important to understand that this is the prehistory of modern Europe. Now, modern Europe likes to call itself secular, but um, there are still a lot of these remnants from uh, the medieval imagination.